Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Emma. What's up? I am just leaving my workout now. I worked out with my trainer this morning on the cave. And I got my dunks today. I, so I got cold brew with extra almond milk and blueberry. It tastes like water today, but it's okay. Yesterday I got a butter pecan and it was so good, but today I was feeling blueberry. I find, this is, I don't know, okay, this is just my theory. Every time I get cold brew with almond milk, it tastes amazing. Like, it tastes so good. Every time I get blueberry shots in it, it's not the same. It tastes very watery. I don't know what it is, maybe it's just in my head, but whatever. Anyway, hi, welcome back. I decided to vlog today. For what reason? I don't know. I have a lot of like organization to do, cleaning to do, things like that. So I thought that you guys would really enjoy like a organizing, getting my life together cleaning vlog. It's going to be a holiday weekend this weekend. And so I'm trying to get everything done before this weekend because I know for a fact that I'm just going to be like in and out of my house this weekend and just be leaving shit everywhere. So we're gonna get organized today and you guys are gonna help me do that we got our workout done I put oil in my hair last night so we have to wash my rat's nest of hair I got my nails done the other day first of all slay slay they they slayed my nail lady this is the lady I've been going to ever since I like first ever got my nails done on Cape and she's a queen she's a literal queen she slayed my nails down better than any person has ever done my nails ever on Cape Cod she slayed I got so I normally get gel extensions and she didn't do extensions like the gel extension she did tips which I've never gotten tips in my life I was always so afraid of tips I thought tips are what ruined your nail what are acrylics I don't know the difference between acrylics or tips or whatever anyway so I got gel extensions with like a hard gel and I think this is literally just like OPI Funny Bunny on top, which is like the go-to. Like, she slayed, she slayed, like slivving on the nails. I asked her for like a ballerina coffin and they're so good. Oh my God, I have really good nail beds. So they look absolutely amazing on my nails, not gonna lie. I'm very happy like I all I do is like if I send a snapchat to someone it's like a picture of my hand so Brenda slay <laughs> literally slay that's so annoying that I just slay. how many times did I just say that you oh my god I'm screaming you guys are gonna be like you're so annoying like shut up okay anyway I'm gonna enjoy my ride home and I'm gonna put the windows down and drive also oh my god another thing my road skincare came last night, so guess who? Guess what we're doing today? We're trying road skincare! <laughs> when I get home, okay. I'm like way too crazy right now, I gotta go. I'm wearing the cutest little set from Frankie's, so like a little t-shirt moment, and then a skirt. It's so cute, this is the new, I think it's the Gigi Hadid collection. <clears throat> but I'm gonna do my skincare right now with you guys. My morning skincare. So, I have all the road products. They came in the mail like yesterday. This is the Barrier Restore Cream. This is the Peptide Glazing Fluid and then all three of the lip treatments. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use the Barrier Restore Cream just because my sister used it and she said that it made her skin break out. I don't wanna risk my skin breaking out so I think we're just gonna go with the peptide glazing fluid because the ingredients won't make my skin break out. But this has shea butter and that's like an acne, not like acne causing, but if you have acne prone skin, it definitely will probably make you break out. I don't know, that's just what my esthetician said. So I'm gonna listen to her because we don't need any breakouts at all. So Paige and I just decided that we're going to the Hamptons this weekend, so. Now I have to pack for that. Anyway, let's do our skincare. So I'm starting out with the peptide glazing fluid, hydration layer, whatever, skin, 
Hailey Bieber face. <laughs> Got a good amount on my hand. And I'm just going to rub it in, I guess. So far, it feels so nice. It doesn't feel like sticky or too drying or anything. Do I look like Hailey Bieber yet? Cool. I have that on. It feels good on my skin. It's not tacky, it's not sticky. It feels very lightweight. It dries quick. I So far, I love it. I'm gonna take the restore, also, it like has no scent, which is good. I don't like scented skincare. I like I have really sensitive skin, so um, I'm gonna put some of the Restore cream on my hand, and that's how we're gonna test it out. No scent. Ooh, it's thick. It literally feels like a shea butter moisturizer. I use that on my body, but ooh. <laughs> It looks so look at my hand my hand literally looks so shiny and glazed <gasps> wow it's very soft i'm gonna let that dry and we'll feel my hand afterwards i'm gonna go in with my beauty counter counter match sleeping cream this is like my daily moisturizer i love this moisturizer it works so well for my skin um i don't break out anymore it feels so great so if something's working for my skin we're keeping it that way because we cannot go for any more breakups. I love this moisturizer. It's a sleeping cream, but it doesn't feel too thick at all. My hand is so soft. I like want to put it on my face so bad. What if I don't break out from it? I don't even want to risk it. Anyway, and then I'm gonna do some eye cream. This is just the Clinique. cream i love a good eye cream i feel like eye creams are one of those skincare products that everyone's like they're so useless i think that they feel amazing i think that whenever i put one on my eyes look so awake and i don't know i just really love an eye cream i used to not be an eye cream girl but I just became my cream girl probably a few months ago. Also, I noticed that when I consistently wear eye cream, my concealer like doesn't crease and get all weird. And then I'm following up with my SPF. This is SPF 40, the Elton D tinted moisturizer, sunscreen, whatever you call it. And I'm just gonna put this on my face. I don't know how often I'll be outside today, but we still put sunscreen on no matter what, even though it's a beautiful day outside. And now I'm gonna use a lip, a lippy lip. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I used the salted caramel one last night because, or this morning, I used the unscented one last night. It felt great. I used the salted caramel one this morning. I like the scent. It doesn't dry on my lips. They stay hydrated, they're still hydrated, and I haven't reapplied since this morning at eight. And it's currently 12.17, so, so far so good. But right now I'm gonna use the watermelon one. The packaging of the stuff is so great, very sleek, which I love. And, ooh, ooh, what does it smell like? Oh my God, all over my nose. Mm. I am a hoe for lip products. I freaking love lip products so much. I'm like, I can tell a good lip product. I swear I've tried everything. Mm. This is better than the, the Laneige um, lip mask because... The scent is really nice. Mm. Look at my lips. They look so good. They feel so good. It's not sticky. And like too thick. 
it's like the perfect consistency and it's so hydrating it feels so hydrating so that's my skincare hopefully i look like i'm glowing because if i don't then yay i'm so excited road go off Haley. this girl could sell like a fucking hair tie and i would buy it i swear i just there's something about like her and justin i just love it love 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 also my hand feels so soft the one that i put the moisturizer on but yeah okay carry on carrying on with the day so here's what we have going on right now <sighs> oh my goodness i'm getting a phone call but anyway this closet's gonna be shirts and more shirts and jeans and stuff skirts and dresses down here and then this is where all my pants are gonna be like jeans and then other pants this I'm gonna redo since that's like random stuff it's literally like comfy stuff the sweatpants that I always wear will go up there and then this is like yoga which I still need to like put my stuff away but whatever <laughs> okay happy afternoon it's been a little bit since I last saw you guys when I was organizing my room it's currently well only like an hour and a half two hours now it's 2 50 and first of all it's 87 degrees outside great love that we love the good heat we love 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 the heat I'm feeling really bloated lately and I don't know why I think it's stress because other than that like I'm chilling I'm drinking a matcha lemonade right now this is the smooth one I've realized I need an afternoon pick-me-up or, or else I will crash at four and not be able to do anything so I don't know I don't know what to do about that the matcha lemonades are great I'm gonna go run some errands I gotta get some stuff from like CVS and whatever so bring you guys with me and I'm hoping my dad will vacuum my car for me later because guess who does not want to vacuum their car me I need to find a car detail place here on the Cape. I know a few friends that detail cars. But I'm nervous to reach out. So let's hope my dad will vacuum my car because there's sand and dirt and grossness everywhere. But till then I'm gonna get some wipes and we're gonna we're gonna clean my car as best as we can. Oh, that's why. Like I'm crashing, see? Like I get exhausted by four, like three or four. And then I sit in bed and I nap for the rest of the day. And then I get up at like eight. Fine. Like I'll literally get up at eight when one of my friends will come over and like save me. Like Ella or Tyler or someone will literally come over and be like, okay, like get out of bed. Like let's go get ice cream or something to get me going. And then I'll like go to bed at 12. I need to not do that either. Well, anyway. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Show you guys what I got at Rory's really quick. I wanted to grab some lunch to have for when I get home. I got two of these, and then I got okay, so I got these for the morning. They're like the little peanut butter balls. I love having these like before or after my workout. If I'm like hungry in the morning before my workout, it's a great thing to just grab. But I got two sandwiches. So this one's for today. It's the Rory's veggie hum. <laughs> veggie hummus wrap it's literally just a wrap with carrots cabbage cucumber tomato peppers and hummus like it's so my mouth's watering it's just like fresh and healthy and good for you and it has whole ingredients and it's great then i got this for tomorrow it's a curry chicken salad wrap they're curly curl Rory's curry chicken salad is so good. So I got this wrap for the beach. I'm literally gonna put it in the fridge when I get home and then tomorrow going to the beach all day. It's 80 degrees. 
So, um, yeah, I'm gonna just grab it in the morning, throw it in the cooler, quick and easy, you know? And I got a Mountain Valley spring water, obviously my favorite is spring water. So yeah, that's my little lunch for the next two. So easy to just like grab a salad, not a salad, so easy to just grab a sandwich and pack it for the beach because I always get so hungry when I'm at the beach. But yeah, anyway, let's go run to CVS for all of my other errands I need to do. Be Real is so funny. My Be Real just went off. Like I don't want to do it right now. I'm like running errands, <laughs> not doing anything cool. I just wiped down the whole inside of my car and it's all clean except for the fact that I can't figure out how to do the vacuum because well it's not that I can't fi look at this this is disgusting it's not that I can't figure it out it simply has so many spiders on it that um, I'm not touching it so I'm just gonna shake off the mats I miss my guys in Newport that would clean my car they did a great job and I don't have them anymore, so. Now it's time for this, because I have something on my car saying, you have none left. So, let me open up. There it is. Yep, there we go. Oh, okay. Oh boy, it's hot. <laughs> Whoever was in here last didn't shut this. There we go. Anyone surprised I know how to do this? Because I sure am. Whoa! <laughs> Why did that happen? I feel like a literal handyman. Get on there. Oh, there we go. Okay, my work here is done today. Okay, I have to pack for the Hamptons tonight, so we're gonna do that. But first, I have to go take content. This so is my outfit. Dress is Princess Polly. Boots are Dolce Vita. Alright, so my makeup and got ready. So, yeah. Let's go get content alone because I have no one to help me. So, guess what? I'm going to use a tripod, which I'm embarrassed to do in my hometown. So, let's do it. I'm going to go humiliate myself at a public beach parking lot in front of my whole town. So yeah, bye. You guys are gonna help me pack today. It's the next day. It's currently Friday right now. July 1st, so happy July. I'm new facing my face because I want to be snatched. Okay, I like needed to put like some sort of fucking shirt on, but anyway. I'm new facing right now and then I have to pack. I have not packed a single thing yet which kind of stresses me out because I have no idea what I want to pack and what I want to bring even though I'm not going for like that one only a few days but still just the one thing I'm like dreading is the drive because I'm driving to don't ask why we thought this was the easiest way but I'm driving all the way to New York today New York City and then we're driving to Montauk tomorrow morning <laughs> like we so could have done this an easier way but no, but yeah, I gotta pack, so I'm gonna leave whenever I'm done packing, and I'm gonna end up bringing my whole closet, which it is nice that I have my car, because then I can literally bring my whole closet, and I don't have to, like, think about travel and, like, what I, like, being smart about packing, because I literally have my whole car. I am taking the ferry home, like, on, there's one that you can get on in Montauk to get to Connecticut, which should be easier on the way home. I was really, really wanting to go out to breakfast today, but no one wanted, no one wanted to come with me. <laughs> my dad left for the beach, and then one of my friends is golfing, one of my friends is working, another one of my friends is sleeping, probably. Um, but I had a pretty early morning. I went to Pilates this morning, which was great. I'm so glad I got that in before I leave. But let's hope and pray that I pack quick. It's just the outfits that I have to do. Everything else is like basically packed. Like my makeup is already in the bags. Like my toiletries are all 
ready. I need to make sure I bring like headphones for when I'm on the boat. Dress option one. The one issue is that I don't have heels, but I'm bringing this dress. Obviously, it's like so, so, so cute. I just need to figure out heels. This is called Gaia Revolve. Super cute, wearing it in an extra small dress, but heels, only issue. All I have is black and one heel from Steve Madden. One, I don't know where the other one is. So those ones like don't look good and I don't like walking in them, but yeah. So dress option one. Dress option two, she's from Princess Polly. We love her so much. She's literally one of my favorite dresses I own. But yeah, again, no idea what I'm gonna do for heels but she's just simple, cute, easy to throw on. So bringing two extra dresses just for like content purposes. This one, I wanna take photos in so bad. I got it at Revolve. It's by the brand Beckin Bridge. It's so, so, so cute. I got it in a size two, beautiful color. And then this one's just, this is an RUMI dress and I just brought it just in case for like a backup if needed. She's so cute. I've never worn her, but it's very simple and goes with quite literally everything and my sister who's not coming but she's on the phone <laughs> hey oh nice am girl hammy okay, i just finished packing i brought the most random stuff for during the day and then my air force is obviously my outfit that i'm wearing today literally just a big t-shirt and shorts and my headphones for the boat and i need to figure out what little tote bag i'm bringing because I, all i have is my big duffel but that's a lot, so I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure out what tote I'm gonna bring, but so far, this is what we've got. Leaving a little early because I genuinely don't know what else to do with my time because I'm done packing and whatever, like I'm done with everything I need to do. So I'm gonna head to New York right now. This is my outfit for driving. Free people, tea, Brandy Melville shorts, Air Forces, although my Air Forces are coming in the mail, like my brand new ones are literally going to arrive any minute. I don't know what to do because I obviously want to wear those, but I'm leaving. So RIP to that because like what? I'm so annoyed. Hi guys, so I am 25 minutes away from Paige right now. I've been driving what feels like all day. Well, it honestly hasn't even been bad. So like, I don't know. It was like a pretty easy drive. It was kind of quick too. So why is this falling? Like it felt quick. I feel like it just went by so fast. No complaints, but I'm almost there. So I'm gonna end off this vlog and I'm starting a new one. I also don't want to vlog and drive because my camera just flies around everywhere. But I'm starting a new vlog for the weekend. So keep a lookout for that. And I'm gonna go, but I love you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!